I greet everybody out there. My name is Queen Lit and I'm a gospel minister. Thank you so much for coming. Please note this. On this platform, we are serving thousands of people, millions of people out of abusive marriages. So please, if you come, share this video to all platforms, all the social media platforms, because you will save somebody from dying out of abusive marriage. God bless you and thank you so much for doing that. Take this from me. In this world, whatever you are doing, huh, somebody will talk about it. They will either speak positive or negative about it. But one thing you have to do is to fear God. If you fear God, you will definitely not offend your sister, you will not offend your brother. If you are able to do this thing that I'm talking about, just move ahead. Close your eyes and close your ears. Because whatever you will do, you will get one person to come and speak against it. Or to come and talk good about it. It is like that. Why is it that Mercy Chiwo is engaged and people are speaking ill about her? Okay? Some people think she, she is a forbidden eater and a protocol breaker. What has speeches got to do with virginity? Why is it that people are saying she's not a virgin? Some even say she's pregnant because of the way she had her husband to be and for that reason, she's not a virgin. I know she's a virgin. So if you don't know, just keep quiet. I know that Mercy Chiwo is a virgin and I'm telling you, take this from me now and keep quiet wherever you are. Stop these things. She's a virgin. Don't you know how virgins behave? Don't you know how virgins do their things? You are not aware who a virgin is. Oh, okay. That is why you are saying that. So if you don't know, I'm telling you today, take this from Queen Lit. I am telling you that Minister Mercy Chiwo is a virgin. Because pictures has got nothing to do with virginity. You are the same people who made Osinachi stay in that marriage and died. Because if she, 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 she wanted to come out, she wanted to come out, but she was afraid of what you, the same people, would say. And she stayed there and died. Mercy Chiwo was not married. Everybody was talking about it. This lady, when is she going to get married? She's getting older. She's getting older. And now she's engaged. And you people have come up again. You have come after her. That she's not a virgin. She's pregnant. The way she had the, the, the guy, it means they are doing something together. They are eating the forbidden fruit. And she, she has sinned against God. And she must go to God in prayer. Hey! Why do you do that? Why do you talk like that? Don't you know that she's a virgin? You don't know. Oh, okay. You don't know. You don't know. So why do you talk about it? Why do you talk about it if you don't know about it? You need to be extra careful. You will see a lady she will close on Sunday and sit in the guy's car and people will be talking. Hey, now this lady, every Sunday she will be jumping into that guy's car. The lady is a single lady. She's not married. Okay? So if she doesn't sit in that guy's car, how can she even talk with the guy? How can the guy ask her that, oh, okay, let's see if things will go on. You'll be doing this, people will be, be there 30 years, 40 years before they'll be looking for men. And you, the same society, you'll be laughing at those people and you'll be saying they are single, they are not married. That is why I'm telling you that whatever you are doing, you need to fear God. Okay? If you fear God and you put your things in prayer, forget about what everybody is saying. Close your ears. Close your eyes. And just move ahead and do what you are supposed to do. Because people can use their mouth to destroy you. I am standing here and I know that this lady is a virgin and people are saying she's not a virgin. You are saying she's not a virgin, but I know that she's a virgin. So just keep quiet and be there. Look, recently in South Africa, okay, a pastor conducted a test on young girls. The ladies, uh, there are many, I can't give you the exact number, but there are many. And most of them, 18 years and above, it will shock you. They were all virgins. They had certificates and they even had a red mark on their head and they, they took pictures. It was so beautiful. So why are you saying she's not a virgin? Do you know about it? You don't know about something. And you just come out to say something just to out of jealousy. I don't even know. This lady is doing well in the industry. She's, she's touching lives. Look at her ministration. If she's saying the same thing like uh, Minister Osinachi. 
She is blessed and she's been blessed to nations. And you want to use your mouth to crash her down. Mercy, I know that by the grace of God, you are a virgin and yet to break the highest human rules of virginity. So don't listen to whatever they are saying. Now listen to me and listen to me well. <laughs> if you read the Bible, 2 Corinthians chapter 5, verse 70, the Bible says, Therefore, if anyone is in Christ, he is a new creation. All things have passed away. <laughs> Behold, all new things has come to stay. New things. Behold, all things have come to stay. Behold, all things have passed away. So new things have come to stay. And those new things that have come to stay includes virginity. So those slave queens you are seeing around, if today they decide to come to Christ, they are virgins. If they decide to walk in the newness of God, they are no more uh, those you knew before. Moving from one man to the other, they are virgins. So if you know somebody in the past who was going about sleeping with men when the person didn't know Christ and the person comes to God, the person is a new creation. And for that matter, those old things are passed away and new things have come to stay. And the person is a virgin. Young girls, don't be deceived. Gone are the days if you are a virgin. The guys were so much happy. They all wanted to marry virgins. The ladies wanted to marry virgins. Now if you are a virgin, it looks like even it is a taboo. And somebody will just even open their mouth and say, Me, I don't want to marry a virgin. Because the virgin, they cannot perform good in bed. Who told you? Something that God has prepared. If somebody say, I want to stay and be virgin. I want to stay for my husband, for my wife. And you are saying, you don't want it. Girls and boys, don't listen to those people. Being a virgin is like gold. It is like gold. People don't talk about it these days. Because they will say if you are a virgin, your eyes are not open. It is never true. It is never true. Okay? You can get pregnant. You can get diseases. You can get all, you are open to all kinds of things. Demonic attacks and those things. If you break your virginity at a time, that you are not married and you don't know Christ. You get all kinds of things in your body, including spiritual things. And if God is not on your side, your life will never be stable. So don't let somebody tell you that if you are a virgin, it's a taboo. And you are a virgin, your eyes are not open. And if you are a virgin, you cannot perform good in, in bed. The man who wants you will meet you. The woman who wants you will meet you. So if you knew Mercy Chin was somewhere, if you knew about her relationship, if you knew about her lifestyle or whatever you knew about her, right now that she's in Christ, she has met her better half. She's a new creature. All things have passed away. New things have come to stay. So she is a virgin. Just keep quiet and be there. Concentrate on your things and pray for your future. If you are not married, Pray, pray about your wife, pray about your husband and leave her to be in peace and do her ministry. She is a virgin, I'm telling you today. So you, you've heard this message. God bless you so much for listening to me, young girls and young, young ladies. Don't be shy, okay? Don't feel ashamed that you are a virgin. Be proud of it. Be proud of it because how many virgins can we count now? How many virgins can we count in this world now? People are doing all kinds of things and they are making it look as if virgins are, uh, excuse me to say, foolish people or their eyes are not open or they are not civilized or they are primitive. It is not true. It is not true. Preserve yourself until you meet the right person. So this is a message you need to hear today. Mesichinwo is a virgin because all things have passed away and new things has come to stay. My name is Queen Lit. Make sure you share this video to everybody. Share it to all social media platforms. The name is Queen Lit Music on YouTube, Twitter, TikTok, Instagram. Please, Facebook, follow the page and like the page. Queen Lit Music. Everywhere on all the social media platforms. Queen Lit Music.